YTPC, what's up? It is your buddy Tillerman70H coming at you again. Happy New Year. Happy New Year to everybody. 2021. Let's see what it has in store. See where we're going this year. See how things are going to go. Oh, right? Anyway, this is going to be a, uh, a quick, quickish video. I have here a, uh, a Yabo. It's sort of an expected Yabo, but I don't know what's in it until right now. I just opened it. Uh, for those of you who don't know, I was one of the winner uh, of Flat, uh, Flat Cat Piper and uh, uh, Giveaway. Uh, and... Um, Lady uh, Flat Cap and Lady Fire. That's what that's what I've been trying to trying to get out. So anyway, I won one of their um, prizes, and we're gonna open it up and go through it here. And before we get into anything, got a bro note. Uh, yeah, great, very nice. They thank you for that. My uh, you know enter uh, entering their draw, and they wish me the best for twenty twenty one and success for my channel and everything else. So very nice. Uh, but let's see what we got in here. Got some, uh, got some goodies in here, which is gonna lead me to the second part of my video. Uh, look, look at that, so nicely wrapped. I'm gonna guess, I'm just gonna guess that Lady Fire did that. I'm gonna guess that she put the nice bow on here. I'm just guessing. Anyway, so it says Fireside Cocoa. I bet that's gonna be very nice. So it looks like a sample of that. And let me dig in here a little bit, make sure there's nothing. Yep, okay. Uh, what do we get? Two tins here, let's see what we got. And I think that's it. Okay, so it looks like, boom, 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 I have a tin of holiday 2020 from cornell and deal golden days of yore 2020 edition right there looks like that was 819 of 20. nice i think that's cool that they most of the cornell and deals that i've seen have a date on there which i think is cool um it's just neat for down the road. You're like, man, when did I get that? And then if you forget to write it on there, it's nice that they, they already post that. And then, you know, it's interesting. Uh, I have not tried, I haven't tried, obviously, the golden days of yore, but the, um, got another Cornell and Deal. It's a small batch, and it's the Carolina Red Flake. I have not tried this. I've toyed around. I've had it in my cart a bunch of times and then took it out and put other things on there. Um, I'm reading it as I'm looking, but, uh, so yeah, thank you very much to, uh, Lady Fire and Flat Cat Piper. Um, it's very nice. It's always nice to win something. I don't have the greatest luck at winning, uh, gauze or anything like that. So it's always it's fun when, when they actually get to do that. So I appreciate that. Uh, which brings me to the second part of that. For those of you who haven't, uh, been able to see or look at the um, live stream that I did on New Year's Eve. Um, I am also doing a GAW, and it started, it actually morphed in the discussion um, from that live stream. I originally wanted it to be like, hey, 2020 sucked, as everybody knows, but they're it's funny how food, which kind of went in line with Flat Cat Piper's um, gaw, like how food can sometimes cheer everybody up. So what is your favorite struggle meal or comfort food? And then that morphed into a bunch of guys talking about some stuff and then tobacco. So it's actually that as a side, that's the second part of it. If you want to add that in for extra credit or whatever. But the other one was if you had three tobaccos that you were going to tell, so now they don't necessarily have to be your favorite or it's not the desert island, like what would, if you could only smoke one for the, but just three tobaccos that you would recommend that somebody must try. So something that you would say like, man, you know, it wasn't the greatest, but I liked it. I think that, you know, three that you would think that you would recommend that somebody try without fail. 
What do you think of that? And for just for fun, it's because I'm interested and it's interesting to me, what would you um, uh, have as your favorite struggle meal, as they used to call it, or your comfort food sort of thing? So uh, without making this too long, but that's it. So I'm going to have a gall. There's going to be, um, I'm going to keep it kind of secretive. There's going to be a number of tobaccos and tins and samples and stuff like that in there. And there may or may not be a uh, smoking instrument in there as well. So, but I like flat cap pipers kind of, uh, he kind of kept it a hit. He said, look, there's a bunch of stuff that I've got and we'll see what you get when you get it. And so I kind of, kind of like that, thought that was fun. It's opened uh, to everyone. Again, you have to be 21 years of age. You have to be a subscriber. Smash the subscribe button, spread the word, tell folks, join, subscribe. It's really not that painful to watch. It's pretty interesting stuff. I don't know, so I think. Put that out. Um, if you're overseas and it's it's going to be a pain for you, if you're a winner and you're an overseas winner, we'll figure something out. Maybe I'll do like a gift card or something instead. Um, but we'll, we'll figure it out. So it's open to everybody. So smash the subscribe button, like, share, comment, all that thing. Um, post your video on this link, this one. Um, and then we'll go from there. So until next time, it's Tillerman 70H saying, see ya.